All right, fam, so before we get into the video, man, hit the like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications so we can continue to spread the truth all throughout this nation, bro. That kind of, that kind of run. I ain't gonna lie. That wasn't even playing. But we need to continue to spread the truth all throughout America, man. So make sure y'all hit the like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications. Without further ado, we got a crazy, crazy video. Let's go ahead and get into this, man. Let's get it. Let's go. <laughs> Hold on, let me see. Let me. I, he said, "Don't knock on my window like that." I just want to see how did he knock on the window. Let's see. <laughs> Why do you have your seatbelt on? Hey, keep your window down. Keep your window down. I'm gonna get you out of the car. As a matter of fact, get out of the car. Give me your ass. Get out of the car. Give me your ass. We'll break that freaking window. Get out of the car. Get out of the car right now. We're not playing this game. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. What part of Dallas do you understand? Hey, Drew. Hey, Drew. I'm getting arrested, Drew. I'm getting arrested. I'm getting arrested, Drew. I'm getting up, bro. God damn, twin. When we tell you to do something, you do it. I'm getting you understand? Up. I'm getting up, you bro. understand? Not what you want, but I'm, what we tell you. I'm getting You're a little out. fucking confused. I'm getting out, bro. Too late. Chill, bro. Too late. All right, bro. Take Too me late. to jail, bro. Do what you gotta do, bro. We are. We will. Good, good, bro. It hey, is good. Hey, Drew. Hey. Don't worry about it. I hung up the phone. Can you stop crying? Bro. <laughs> Yo. Don't move. Good. Bro, you Sit beating on my window like you crazy. Alright, it's a it's a lot of things I just already peeped. <laughs> First of all, I don't know who peed in that officer cereal, but boy, he having a bad he having a bad, bad morning. Now, I'm gonna talk from two sides. Okay, now number one, let, let's get this right off the rip. First of all, the way you do not raise up a tinted window like that in front of officers. If y'all don't know, that had to been like 5% tint. Now, I don't know the lowest tint that you can possibly go down to. I know my car got 35. No, my car has 15% tint. So my car is, is pretty tinted. It, it's dark at night, but during the daytime, you can see. That is some dark, dark tint. And you have the police right there at your whip. And you raise the window up right in front of the police. While you have police surrounding your car, you raise your window up. Think from a police perspective. They don't know you just as much as you don't know them. You know that they're law enforcement, but they don't know you from a can of paint either. You know what I'm saying? And you raising a tenant window up right there while they're right there, right there. You're raising a tenant window up. We don't know what you're doing behind that window. You could be cocking a gun. You could be getting a gun prepared. You could be doing anything behind that window. I understand you, Tyreek Hill. You you a you a you a superstar, a super or a superstar in the football in the football field or whatever. But at the end of the day. That doesn't give you the right to raise up a window that tenant and while the police is right there trying to do a traffic stop. You said don't beat on my window like that. If the police pull you over, the first thing you do is raise down your window. You don't keep it up. I don't care if you don't got no tents. You got tents, you raise down your window. Anybody know that? Well, anybody, sh everybody should know that. That, you, that the first thing you do is you sit there and you raise down your window. Raise down your window. So he won't have to knock on your window the way he did. And I don't even know if he knocked on it super hard or what. It look, It's like a simple knock to me. But he shouldn't have to knock on your window. He should easily come to your car, ask for your license registration, or I mean license and uh, insurance or whatever, and do a simple traffic stop and you, and you get going. You get on by your day. But yet you raised up your window. I, I never seen that happen before. Who raises up their window, bro? That, that's 5% tent. That's, that's issue number one. Issue number two is bro, dude, Tyreek Hill was getting out the car. 
the dude with the tattoos on his hand, that was that unnecessary force, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. That was unnecessary, bro. He ain't, he ain't had to pull bro out by the neck and all. He, you seen he moving towards. It wasn't like he was just sitting there like, no, I ain't getting out. I ain't getting out. I ain't get. He literally was about to get out the car, and yeah, you use executive force to push him on the ground. I feel like that was very unnecessary. I feel like that should have been handled in a in a total different manner. In a total different manner. But we're gonna go ahead and finish because we already have one minute and forty, and this minute this is three minutes. So I want to finish to see what the officers do and what Tyreek Hill do and his response to everything. So let's see. You set him up. Why y'all being on my window like y'all crazy for? Damn, yo, 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 bro, oh. Bro, bro, yo, bro, dude, beating on my window like he crazy. I ain't do nothing, twin. Damn. Hey, don't park there. Don't park there. Hey. Hold on, twin. Hold on. Hold on, bro. I just had surgery on my knee. I just had surgery on my knee, bro. I just had surgery on my knee, bro. Yeah, bro, bro had a bad day, bro. Bro had a bad day and he took it to work, bro. All of that is unnecessary, bro. Bro saying, look, I got surgery on my knee. He said, give me a second, bro. I got surgery on my knee. He can't go nowhere. He's in handcuffs. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure he won't go nowhere because he know his status. He has a high status. He know he won't. He can't go nowhere. Like, ah, oh, man. I tell you in your ears when we bro, go there. Bro, chill, bro. bro. Chill, bro. Hey, don't do, bro. Back up. Hey, call, call, call Drew. 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 Hey, call Drew. Call Drew, bro. Call Drew. Call Drew. Hey, call Drew, bro. Hey, why you hey, 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 call Drew, bro. Just call Drew. Hey. I'm not going in there. I'm not going what am I doing this wrong? Hey, listen, listen, listen. Hey, hey, listen. Hey, man, they got Tyreek. The cops over here beating on him, man. They over here beating on Tyreek, man. Listen, big man. Don't park there, man. Just get in the car. Hey, Drew, you got to come, man. Just get in the car. Right off the side, on the side of the aisle. Hey, get in the car. You're parked at the middle of the street. I'm in the car. You got to go before you get a ticket. Hey, you're in the car. Who's the driver? This is my car. All right, move. All right, I'll take that. You got to move right now. Let me have your license. You're going to have to get I'm coming. Let me have your license. You're going to have to Let me have your license. I'm leaving. I'm not playing. Let me have your license. I'm leaving. Yo, what's going on? Your license right now. What's going on, Your license right now. You're not going to give me your license? Hey, 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 hey. You're not going to give me your I'm license? Leave. I'm leaving. Let me have I'm your license. Leaving, your license I'm right leaving. now. Sir, you want hey, me your leave. license I'm right leaving. now. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Or I'm going to lock you up. Your me license me. right now. He just told me to Your leave. license right now. Sir, just... You're dealing with me now. Sir. Your license sir. right now. <sighs> Look. Anybody who's saying this is justified, it's not. I, I, I done dealt with rude people before, and I'm telling you now, this is not how you deal with it. Uh, this is not how you And I'm like, he wasn't even rude, honestly. You know what I'm saying? Granted, they are parked right here. He should have been moved. He, you know what I'm saying? But I feel like, I don't know who. I think he, I think he, it's on the Miami Dolphins, if I'm not mistaken. I think he's on the team with Tyreek. I'm not, I don't know. I don't watch football, to be exact. So, I, I don't truly know. You know what I'm saying? But, however, Certain things just shouldn't have got to this point. You know what I'm saying? Certain things just shouldn't have got to this point. You feel me? Tyreek Hill, was he in the wrong? Yes, he was in the wrong for raising up a 5% tenant window in front of the police. That's unacceptable, bro. That's unacceptable. I like, I like, that's just not what you do. You know what I'm saying? I don't care how big status you got. That's not what you do, bro. You don't raise up a tenant window, 5% tenant at that. Or it could be 0%. I don't know the tent that famous people be having on their car, but I know it'd be dark that you can't see in that thing. You feel me? You can't see in that car. They don't know what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, that was unacceptable. You know what I'm saying? But pulling him and dragging him out the car, pushing him on the ground, like, all that was unnecessary. You know what I'm saying? All that was unnecessary. But at the end of the day, I want to say this. This is why you cooperate with the police. And I know it's so many people thinking this is racially motivated and all this. This ain't racially motivated. It ain't got nothing to do with race. So I, for people on Twitter saying this is race, this is that, this, this is what happens if you vote Trump into the office. Let, let me actually show y'all that, bro. <laughs> let me actually show y'all that, bro. That junk had me. I'm like, well, what, bro? What are you talking about, fam? Here we go right here. It's a... And black men voting for Trump will get more of this with broken windows, policing, and stop and frisk. 
Stop and frisk is for everybody. Broken windows is for everybody. It ain't just black people, bro. This ain't. This is not a race thing. You know what I'm saying? It's truly not a race thing. But I feel like certain things just didn't need to be taken to the level it was taken to. You feel me? I don't. I don't know. Maybe some of y'all will agree. Maybe some of y'all will disagree. But at the end of the day, I know what I seen. I don't think it's a race thing. And at the end of the day, I feel like Tyreek should never raise his window up. Why the police is right there? You know what I'm saying? He rolls his window up as that was like an entitled move or something. I don't know. But again, that police with the with tattoos on his hands, bro, whatever problems you got outside of work, don't bring that to work, fam. Don't bring that to work because all the taking them down on the ground and all that was uncalled for, bro. That was that that was uncalled for, bro. It didn't need to get to that extent. Like, bro said, look, I had surgery on my knee. Like, hold on, bro. And you still, yeah, tackle them to the get on the ground. Like, all oh, that was unnecessary, man. It's certain ways you talk to people because I don't care if you're a police. I don't care if you're in the army. I don't care. There's a certain way that you should talk to an individual because at the end of the day, we're all humans. That's the problem. We're all humans. I wouldn't talk to anyone less than because I feel as if I'm higher up than them. Even if I was a sergeant, I wouldn't talk to, to people that's under me a certain way. I wouldn't get on the ground. I wouldn't do all that, bro. It's a certain way you talk to an individual, bro. We're still humans at the end of the day. Call it soft, call it what you want, but I don't talk to certain people a, a, a certain way because at the end of the day, I know they're humans. They have feelings just as much as I have feelings. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, it's like, bro, certain ways you talk to people, certain ways you handle certain things. But I heard that this guy, he was um, he was on a leave, uh, administrative leave, man. So right here, uh, the Miami Dalton, well, Bleacher Report posted that officer involved in Tyreek Hill incident placed on administrative leave. So he was placed on administrative leave, man. And, I, and when you see all these things, like, bro, I just keep these videos in my life so it's easier for me to find because, bro, if I don't like it, bro, it'd be hard for me to find this junk. So I just like them. But the problem with this is that I, I don't feel like it was necessary to put him on administrative leave. I don't think that was necessary to do. You know what I'm saying? But, I mean, did I guess that's the that's the that's the steps that they took to I guess almost was suspending him or fire him probably, but I don't think it was necessary. You know what I'm saying? Bro could have been having a bad day at work or a bad day in general. You know what I'm saying? Wife could have cheated on him, whatever. If anything can happen, he just took it to work. This this situation is getting bigger than what it's supposed to get, bro. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, bro, Tyreek Hill, you was in the wrong, and the officer with the tattoos was in the wrong. You know what I'm saying? The only officer I can, the only officer I truly liked out of this whole situation was the officer that had the body cam recording from the body cam. It seemed like he was more trying to calm down situations, like, "Hey, yo, like, just, just leave, bro. Just, just go ahead and leave." You know what I'm saying? Or, you know, he like, hey, "Man, just get out the car. Come on, come on, just get." Like, it's just like he was more the calm person. He was more trying to treat them as, as a human being, and not a freaking pet, not a freaking dog. You know what I'm saying? That's just the problem with this whole thing. But regardless, man, y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section below. Don't raise up your windows in front of the police, bro. I don't care if you got tense or no tense, bro. That's just unacceptable, bro. Don't raise your window up when the police are stopping you. And when they are stopping you, have your window already down, bro. Have your window already down, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section below, man. It's me, your boy, Japan. I love each and every one of y'all. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.